Huskies are strong. Smaller ones. Major. Almost pulled me down to the ground just now. They get so excited when they go anywhere. Look at those little kitties. Cute little kitties. You guys settle down. You've been here before. It's not like you you've never been here. Hello. Hello. Look how nice the kitties are. You think so? Yeah. Uh, this one's this one's much bigger than this one. He's right, but I mean, just when you glance at the dog, yeah, they look like twins to me. You think so? He's mixed with something. He's a thoroughbred Siberian Husky, but this one, yeah, we don't know what he's mixed with. Yeah, well, somebody left him on the side of the road. He was seven years old. So, yeah, that's ignorant too. So they got they got their shots. You did really good. They didn't even cry. And for both dogs to get their rabies shot and their hard guard medicine, it was only like one one fifty. There you go. And that's really good. Because if we had taken them to the humane society, it would have been much twice that much. And this is just a little mom and pop veterinarian right here that we go to. So they're much cheaper and they're really good and they know our dog, so I'm pleased. So that movie the name of that movie we're going to see is Gravity with Sandra Bullock and um I can't remember who else but I just uh saw the trailer. It looks like it's really gonna be good. So I'm looking forward to that. Brian had to go to the D M V to pay two dollars, something about he has a CDL license and every year you have to pay an extra two dollars. Um, something weird, I mean, something strange, I don't know. I think it's a scam. But anyway, he has to pay two dollars so that if he gets stopped by the police, they'll see that his insurance card is in the pack or something stupid like that. But anyway, I'm over here by that Spirit Halloween store. Some scary stuff in there. We were just talking about uh, when, if hopefully we'll have a kid by Halloween, and the cute little costume that we were going to do for our kid, and the child is going to be young from zero to four. So we're just thinking of cute costumes. And my goddaughter, I want to show you a picture of what they dressed her up as. She's so cute. A little mouse. Can you guys see that? She is a cutie pie. <laughs> so, um, my best friend hates mice. So she's like, why did they get a mouse costume? Oh, okay. I guess he forgot something. So anyway, I'll let you guys uh, see it once we pick out a cute little costume. They said by the end of next week, we should be getting a call for a child. So I am so excited, guys. I'll definitely keep you guys in the loop and let you know what we're going to um, dress them up as. Someone just text me. Okay, so I'll okay, see you guys. So we just left J.C. Penney's and we got a lot of stuff. There's J.C. It's crazy tech. I guess they sent everybody coupons, like 15% off and 25% off. And so... Um, we bought myself a bunch of winter and fall clothes, and Brian got a few things that he liked. And um, so we're coming out of J.C. Penney's. We're at the mall, and this lady is waiting for this other lady to come out. The other lady knows that she's got somebody waiting on her, so she intentionally sits there and starts going through her purse and taking her time. And there's like a line of cars waiting for this one lady to come out so the other lady can get her parking place. She was just being ignorant. That's stupid. I don't know. Why do people do that, baby? I don't know. That's that's just ignorant. So, but I'm gonna. Baby, hello, hello. <laughs> so silly. So I'm gonna do a haul. I got a lot of stuff. I'm very happy with all the deals. Ryan picked out a couple things. He's got good taste, guys. 
When it comes to clothes, he's got real good taste. Oh, well, when it comes to women, too, because he married me, didn't he? I was going to say, there's your mom. But it's not your mom. All right. In a minute. So we're on our way to our um, date night to see the movies and everything and have dinner. And I'm excited. I can't wait to see this movie, Gravity. I heard it was really good. So I'm looking forward to that. All right. The movie was at like 10 minutes to spare. It started raining. It's sprinkling just a little bit. And we had to park a long ways off. Oh, and I have these flip flops on. I don't have to walk in there. Okay. There's the movie theater. Right over there. It's really nice. Oh, this is what the movie theater looks like. Do the frog. Ribbit. <laughs> oh, we were not impressed with that movie at all. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Not so much. Don't waste your money. Commercial. Yeah, the commercial showed all this action and. Yeah, we were expecting more action and just pretty much people floating in space and. That's <laughs> pretty weak. Yeah. So the food was good though. <laughs> <laughs> But next time I'll pick the movie. Usually Brian's good about picking movies. Uh -huh. Oh well. So we're so disappointed. That movie was just not what we expected at all. I mean, he said it got great reviews. Like the critics were saying it rated a 9 out of 10, People's Choice. And we weren't the only ones that felt that way. There was a couple behind us that was like, Really? Is this the movie? The way it ended? I mean, you guys can go spend your money if you want to, but that was crazy. I mean, we spent too much money for for the movie that didn't even we didn't even enjoy. Cause, did you forget something? Uh, uh. That's nice. <laughs> oh well, you live and you learn. The next movie will be better. We're gonna see The Hobbit when it comes out at Christmas time. We're going to go see that, and I know that's going to be good. But we're just disappointed with this gravity. It was, it just sucked. And we're not the only ones that felt that way. To have spent all that money for, you know, dinner, and we thought the movie was going to be great. It was just... Well, the food was good. I can't say the food wasn't good. And the company was even better. It's just that we were expecting... You know how you... You expect a movie to be good because you hear all these people talking about it and how great it is. And then when you see it, you're like, really? Is this it? Is that the ending of the movie? Are you kidding? And everybody was saying that. It was so funny. I wish I had a thought to turn on my camera. But people were just sitting in their seats after the movie like, are the credits really rolling? Is this it? And I hate that my two favorite actors were in it because now it's like they're a part of that bad movie. Sandra Bullock and uh, Clooney. Jeez. Oh, well, we're filling up. The gas is really cheap here. For the first time in a long time, it's like 292. I was looking for a sign. 292 for the cheap gas and then 307 for the expensive or 324 for the expensive gas. And that's really cheap. We haven't seen it that cheap in a long time. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and end, I think, this time for real. See you later. Bye.